Okay, we are now balancing on the coated foam ball that we're sitting on. And you're working on your abdominals and your thigh muscles and your balancing muscles. Is try to turn 360 degrees without falling off your ball. Take small steps, don't hop. Take small steps, there you go. And can you turn the opposite direction? All right, now can you play catch with one hand? Now, can you turn and face each other and toss each other the ball? Okay, now if you can give one partner both balls and toss two at the same time to your partner. Notice it's the same task, however, much more challenging because now you're standing on an unstable platform. Have a seat on your ball, right? And give each of you a ball, give your partner back the ball. Now while balancing with no body parts touching, play catch with each other. Toss the ball to the other person, there you go. Now you're working on your pecs. You put the ball between your hands and you are squeezing all the air out of it by pushing your hands together. Very good. Okay, now relax, let the ball reinflate, and then you can try again a second time. To make it even more fun, the two of you face each other. Each of you put the ball in your right hand only, and then put, get up to your partner, so each of you have a hand on the ball, left hand on the partner's ball. Now, get in a staggered stance with your feet, very good. Now don't overpower your partner, but the two of you are going to see if you can push together and crush the ball. Don't overpower your partner. Very good. Develop our fingers, our grip strength. Go ahead and see if you can use your fingers and crush the ball. See if you can squeeze that ball so small it will fit inside the palm of your hand. Look at this man, he's doing it. Look at that. Put one knee on your ball until it flattens out. See if you can balance on that ball just on your knee. If you need to put your toe on the ground, go for it. If you feel I can do it without any toe touching, all the better. Excellent. And now try it with your other knee. Eggs and put the ball between your knees. Let's see if you can squeeze that ball flat using your knees. Bend your knees. Okay, and then relax. Okay, we are working on our neck muscle simply by using the ball as a pillow against a wall. And the further out you lean, the more weight you put on your neck, the more work you're doing in developing your muscle. And remember, you can also do it on the side of your head so that you're working on the side of your neck muscle. Keep your neck straight, keep your body straight. And also your forehead, 